Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to walk about half a mile and without further ado, let's just get right into it. I'm gonna meet you back here. We're gonna start in an easy walk. Nice. So beginning with a nice gentle pace, we're just gonna walk it out. Starting in our gentle walk, I'm going to go ahead and set my watch for indoor walk. You can also set your watch if you have a smart watch or otherwise I'll keep time for us. And we're not going to be here very long. This is going to be a quick, short and sweet workout, half a mile. You're still going to get benefit from this workout. It's just going to be a little bit less time. So if you're crunch for time, especially if you're busy running around in the morning, this is a great workout for you. Also, it's a great bridge to um, the next step up, which would be a mile walk with me. So if that's a little bit daunting, this is a great one to start with. So beginning in our easy walk, we have four basic moves. This is the first one. This basic walk is our home base. We always come back here. So we're gonna do other exercises, but we always return to basic walking. And you got this. So pick up the feet, your pace, as always, go at your pace, keep moving. Um, you know, that's the key here is stay active, stay moving, but always take a break if you need a little break. Of course, have water close by. Um, and that's really the only requirement. I want you to stay hydrated throughout the workout, so always take a break if you need to. Let's take our next move. I'm just gonna turn to the side. We're gonna lift the knee, lift the knee, yeah. And then it's like a little march here. You might wanna start to connect the right and left hemispheres of the brain by tapping opposite hand to opposite knee. You don't have to rush. You know, take your time, your own pace here. In fact, sometimes I think slower is a bit more challenging because you're standing on one leg a little bit longer. Nice. And we're here for five, four, three, two, one. Return to your walk. So good. Nice. And I'm not sure if we've met yet. Um, I'm so happy you pressed play. My name is Emily. This is my rescue Charlie. I don't know if you can see him, um, but he is here with us all the time with every workout. And yeah, I'm a registered nurse, a yoga teacher, and a wellness professional. And I've created this channel for folks just like you and me that need a little pick-me-up, um, that wanna feel better at any age or any stage of the game. So we do these wellness walking videos, and I also teach some gentle stretches and yoga videos as well. So, so happy that you're here and we're connecting. So glad that you decided to press play and take a walk with me in the comfort of your own home. Nice, let's take a side step. So our next move is just gonna be a step out and back, yeah. Keep it light, you can stay upright. Eventually we'll sink a little bit lower, but for now, we're just warming things up, especially the hip joints. Take good care of those. Yeah, and just side to side. The cool thing about these workouts is you're not learning dance moves. I'm keeping things nice and simple so that we can stay on pat, on point and, and so that it encourages you to be consistent with your workout. Five, four, three, two, and one. Return to your walk. Nice job. So we just have one more basic move. We're gonna get right into it just in a second. Just wanna recalibrate here in this um, basic walk. Check in with the breath. How are you breathing? I want you to try and see if you can say like a five or six word sentence and take that talk test, that's why I call it, um, throughout this workout. So if you feel too winded to say a five word sentence, um, step back, you know, come back, take a break, and then um, reassess, maybe slow things down a little bit and come back in when you're ready. Last move, I'm gonna to turn to the side. We're gonna take a kick, so kick and kick. Same as always, your range of motion, maybe you reach opposite hand out, maybe you draw the belly button in towards the spine. So a little bit of core work here. We're here for five, four, three, two, and one. Walk it out, nice job. Super easy, those are the four basic moves. We're not learning dance moves. Um, yeah, I love to keep things simple. 
And guess what? We are almost halfway through our half mile. Can you believe it? So I want to get a dynamic workout in. Let's get the arms moving. Find a little circle here. Nice. Either direction. It's fine. We always balance things out. Find a deep inhale, deep exhales. Nice. Let's reverse those wherever you are. Just find a different circle. Ooh, nice. And we're here for three, two, and last one. Nice big circles or small circles. Give it a shake out. Step to the side. Let's take our side steps. Easy here, light. Have some fun. We are not going to be here long, but I promise you are going to get a great workout today. If you do need more, I have plenty of other videos that you can work out. You can just tack on to the end of this video. Nice. Five, four, three, two, and one. Return to your walk. Find your breath. Nice. Blow that air out. Nice. I'm going to turn to the side. We're going to take our knee lifts up and up and up and up. Fingertips will come to the shoulder blades, reach up as the leg goes up. Yeah. So a different engagement of the core. That 360 core is fired up and turned on. And we're here for five, four, three, two, one. Return to your walk. Nice job. Take your feet wide for me. Keep walking. Yeah. And this is where we're gonna get into those backside muscles. So think the hamstrings, the glutes, the back end, call them the muscles of independence. We keep those nice and strong at any stage of life. That's gonna keep us healthy and active. We strengthen those muscles so we can get up and down more easily from seated in the chair or even seated on the floor. We wanna have strong backside muscles. Nice, so having said that, let's take a kickback. We're just gonna kick one leg back and the other leg, yeah. And just keep that going. Sometimes slower is better, so if you can slow it down just a little bit, you get a little bit more activation of different muscles. Five, four, three, two, one. Return to your walk. Gentle walk. I'm feeling it, I hope you are too. So good for you. Fingers will come back up to the shoulders. Let's extend the arms high, back down out and back in. Keep it going. Yeah. For five, four, three, got this, two, and last one. Nice. Bring it back in. So good. Let's take our kicks. Kick it out. Yeah. Reach opposite hand out. Oh yeah. Belly button draws in. We want a strong, stable core. So front and back of the core, tight and strong. Whew. Nice. For five, four, three, two, and one. Return to your walk. Nice job. This workout is going by so fast, I can't even believe it. It's so nice. Let's widen our stance again. I don't know about you, but I am definitely sweating already. <laughs> nice. We're going to take some knee lifts with this wider stance. So if you want to just bring your feet about hips width apart or wider, just depending on your body. And then here we go. Knee lift, knee lift. Maybe opposite hand reaches. Tap that knee. Wow. Yeah. I feel it. Lots of things are turned on. Full body workout here. Five, four, three, two, one. Walk it out. Nice job. So I'd love for you, if you're enjoying this video and my other videos, I would love for you to support my channel. And there are several free ways to do that. One would be to subscribe to my channel. So I have new videos coming out every week. So that way, if you subscribe, you won't miss a video. Um, also like this video and maybe even leave a comment. And a comment would just be, thanks Emily, I appreciate the video. Something like that, something simple. <sighs> Blow that air out. Um, yeah, and if you do connect, I appreciate it so much. That's just gonna help other people connect and find this channel so that I can help more people, which is truly what I wanna do. I just wanna help as many people as I can. 
Nice. Stay here. Let's take a tap. So tap the toe, tap the toe. Yeah. Ooh. Where are we? We are so close already. My goodness. And that's just about 10 minutes. You know, it doesn't take long to get healthy. Being consistent and staying on track is going to be your best bet. So staying consistent, getting the work in, doing your workout, maybe three to five times a week, and being consistent with it is going to, you're gonna see all kinds of great results. For five, four, three, two, one. Return to your walk. Let's cross that finish line strong. Here we are for three, two, and one. Nice job, we did it, so good. Look how easy that was. I hope you had fun. Let's go ahead and slow it down. We never skip this cool down. Whew. So start to slow down your pace a little bit, stay moving. We're gonna bring the heart rate down, bring the breathing down, start to regulate that nervous system. Maybe you take some baby taps here. Just tap it out, tap it out. Ooh, so good. So yeah, right here, this would be a great place to pause the video and try another walking video if you're interested. Or if you're here and you're like, nope, I'm done for the day. Great job, I'm so proud of you. Let's cool it down. Nice, three, two, and one and find a comfortable standing position. I like to take the feet uh, about hips width apart just for a wide base of support. Let's take an inhale, sweep the arms high to the sky. Exhale, release the hands down. This time we're just gonna draw one arm to the sky, take an in breath, out breath, fold the opposite way for like a little banana pose. Nice, drop that hand. Second side, inhale, reach tall. Exhale, fold the opposite way. Nice, release that down. Shake out those hands a little bit. Let's take a little breathing practice. I love to introduce folks to this. So this is something you can just tack on at any point in your day. We're gonna have the hands facing forward. Inhale, draw the hands to about shoulder height. Exhale, softly release the hands down. Let's do it three more times. Take an inhale. Maybe close down the eyelids. Exhale, softly release. And again, in breath. Out breath, let something go. This will be our last time. Inhale. And exhale. Job. You deserve a round of applause. I am so proud of you um, for getting the work done, being staying consistent, and taking time to take care of yourself. Um, if you would like to connect with me further, you can check me out online. My website is emilydarty.com. There you'll find I um, am doing all kinds of neat stuff online these days. I do have a new program coming out. It's called 30 Day 5K, and it prepares you to walk a 5K in your own home in, in four weeks. So we start at one mile and then gradually build to the 3.1 miles for graduation day. It's super cool. I would love for you to check it out. And of course, reach out if you have any questions. I am here for you and I will see you again in the next video. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.